That's far enough, Bruce. Jeremiah, you don't have to do this. But I, I do. See, I, I came to this realization. I realized that no matter what I did to bond us, some random gunman in an alley would be the man who you were tied to the most. The man you saw when you closed your eyes. I want to be the star of the show. So if I can't have you as a brother bonded by love, then we'll just have to be bonded by hatred. And you think killing two people that look like my parents will do that? It won't. Well, it's a good thing I already put a bullet in both of their fraudulent skulls. Oh, you're confused. You're wondering if I already shot them, then who's this lovely couple? Thomas, Martha, why don't you turn around? Jim! <laughs> I know. See, uh, over the course of our little adventure, fate brought to me James Gordon and Leslie Tompkins, and I thought to myself, why not? Uh, why not kill the man who you think of as your second father figure? And your dear, dear, dear friend, Lee Tompkins. And when I do, finally you and I will be bound together. Because you see... Reunification with the mainland hangs on by a threat. Those fireworks go off, and toxic chemicals rain down onto the city, and the government cuts us adrift for good. The piece de resistance. One last thing. I had Jervis Tetch hypnotize them so that they'll wake up the moment these beautiful pearls hit the ground. I want you to see them realize what I've done to them as the life drains from their bodies. Never forget. This is all for you, Bruce. No! no! Selena and the pearls! Stop the fireworks, they're gonna... I know. You go after Jeremiah and Echo, I'll take the truck. 